It's hard to believe that Ireland's longest running soap for a city will celebrate its 30th anniversary next week on September 18th. So to celebrate, we've gone behind the scenes to see what really goes on. Plus we're meeting its longest surviving character. Let's see who it is. Hey, is it you. safe? How are we doing? How are we doing? Welcome to my home from home. You've been here a long time, Tony. Yes, I have. More than you would realise. Yeah, I'm too long, some people say, but I'm happy enough anyway. Brilliant. Will you show us around? I will. Hi. I'll show you all the hot spots. Yep. This set, when we started 30 years ago, there was only this amount of uh, places here, and it was all filmed up on top of the garage, or on top of that car park, because that's, that's all they thought they could afford. But look at us now, we have a whole street, whole town. As a soap's resident love rat, which is a lovely title, where, where does most of uh, the action happen? In that house there, my house, see that house? So that's, uh, you can go in there, I don't know if it's open, we'll go and see if you like. So, 30 years, is it hard to believe you've been there that long, yeah. since the very, very start? Yeah, if someone had told me at that day, you could have come in here for the audition, you know, because if you know, you're going to be here 30 years time, but it's said, yeah, good luck. But you know what, I'm lucky. I'm one of the few actors in Ireland who've been w working constantly for 30 years, so it's a big deal, you know. And the people love it, and I think it's, it's relevant today because it keeps up with kind of social issues as well, you know, which is kind of, which is great. Kind yeah. of, you know, and it's kind of, and I think that's why it's popular, it still holds its popularity, you know. I'm lucky enough, and kind of, it's interesting to play as an actor, it's great, you know, kind of, because nothing's ever going to be, I don't think Paul's ever going to just going to go into a McCoy's and just ask for a pint and sit down, do you know what I mean? So yeah. there's always going to be something behind it. Everyone always asks, do you have real pints in McCoy's? We do, yeah, and they're lovely, and they're free, which is great, they're always cold, the lads always look out to you. But the worst thing is, when you start filming at 7 o'clock or 8 o'clock in the morning, the worst thing you have to do is knock, knock back a pint. You actually have to drink them? Yeah. It's not, it's, not a late, it's not a hard trip at about five o'clock, you know, but other than that, it's all right.